Welcome back, my friends. Thank you very much for taking another journey with me through Vinyl Records. I'm going to display for you some 12 inch singles, LPs, and also I got a stack of 45s. This is actually part two. Uh, this is another installment of records I've been collecting for over a year. So I'm so happy to show it for you. And I'm so overwhelmed by all your comments. I want to thank you very much. I try to answer all of them as much as I can. And I want to make a comment to one of my listeners. He's talked about hidden treasures, like you find hidden treasures in those bargain bins. Well, they got this record shop. When I come in, the owner knows I go for the 12-inch singles. And he tells me about the box under the bargain bin. So I go to the box, and I pull this one out right here. This is the original American Soviets by CCCP. That's uh, Gorbachev and also Ronald Reagan playing chess. This is the original pressing from 86. This is off of Clockwork Records right there. I never see that in the United States ever. This is the first time I've ever seen this in a box here at a local record store. Usually when I find American Soviets, it's on Oakland Records, uh, more the gray color, the original, and also the Cameron Paul remix on the red label. So I'm so happy to get this. It's been a long time waiting. Uh, another one I pulled out the box is live cinema. This is pop density, more electro and synth pop. And this is off of Bruhaha Records. And this one came out in 87. Another one I pulled out, this is Succession. This is The Magician. And this also came out in 87. This is off of Side Records. I've never seen uh, any Succession record without the actual pictured cover. So, so lucky. Anything I get by Succession, it has the actual uh, jackets to go with it. And when I seen the Fantasy label, I was hoping for Cybertron, and there it is. Here's R9. Uh, this particular track came out in 85. Remember, Clear came out in 83, Techno City in 84, and 85, he gave us R9. Good Electro Techno. Uh, from New Order, I pulled this one out. This is True Faith. Uh, also had True Faith on another record label, but I got the original. Another one by New Order that I pulled out was Bizarre Love Triangle. It doesn't have the actual text on there, but when you see this cover, you know it's New Order. Here's one that was on my want list. I've seen it so many years ago, probably 15 years ago in a record shop, and uh, they wanted a lot of money for it. So being in this bargain bin, when I seen it, I couldn't believe I got it. The Invincible Limits. This is Push. I guess it's more uh, EBM, industrial music. And it's off a ZYX record label. ZYX is an excellent record label. And some synth pop. I got Erasure, A Little Respect. Really good. And the good thing about these records I got from the bargain bin, they're anywhere from VG Plus to near mint condition. So I'm very satisfied with it. Now here's one I didn't know it existed. Now I had this on... Uh, another electro label and this is defcon this is by impact i've never seen this uh jacket before i don't even know which uh record label it is i'll be dog it's a uh it's clockwork records it's the same uh german pressing and i think this one came out in 86 so i don't know if this this is the very original or the other one is the original and the last record I got from this box was right here. When you see BAD, that's Bad Audio Dynamite. And this one's called Everybody Beatbox. So that was a pretty good tune right there. Okay, uh, going to another record store. I pulled this one out right here. This is off Midtown Record Label. That's Stevie B's uh, record label. This one's by uh, MC Zeus, It Ain't No Crime. So that's a pretty cool one right there. I guess it's more bass music. Here I got I'm Your Wild Thing by The Mistress and DJ Madam E. This is kind of like the answer to uh, Wild Thing. It says, I Got Your Wild Thing. And it says a promotional. Okay. In the bargain bins, the same box from this second record store. I pulled this record out. I've never seen this record label ever before. This is the first time. And I've had this before in a Razor Made Collector's Edition. So when I pulled it out, I couldn't believe it. 
But this is Harlequin Tears. This is by Ho Ho Cam. And I want to say this is a French pressing. I think it's kind of rare. And uh, it's a really good tune. It's more, I guess, synth pop music. I'm not sure when it came out. I think it's like 1986, 87. So it's a really good hit. So if you get a chance to go to YouTube, pull this one out right here and listen to it. And it's really good. Or you go Discogs. When Discogs is integrated with YouTube. And you can pull this one out right here and listen to it. I think you'll be very happy the way it sounds. Okay. My third record store I went to. And I've seen this record in here. They wanted too much money for it. So I came back like three months later. And I couldn't believe it was still there. And it's the original. Situation Hot. It's by the Arabian Prince and the Sheiks. This is the original on the Macola label. This is the very first pressing. This is more highly collectible. I think the other one's on the Street Cut label, and that's like the second pressing. So if you ever get opportunity, if you see this, anytime you see Macola, pull it out. It's probably going to be a good one. A good West Coast Electro. Another eraser that I got is called Sometimes. Now, that's a really good some pop song. And I think this one was more... I guess more house music. I love to bass. This is uh, by Bardo. I love to bass. There's the picture of the artist right there. Synth pop music. I love Red Flag. And I couldn't believe I got this in near mint condition. This is a Russian radio off Enigma Records. Really good. The good thing about this, uh, any red flag records that you get, they usually got the Razor Maid versions on it. And they got a couple Razor Maid versions on here, club mix, dub mix. Excellent record. If you ever go opportunity to get some red flag music, get this one right here, Russian Radio. Went to a thrift store, and I don't usually go to thrift stores. I usually don't get lucky, but I, I think I got pretty lucky with this one. Off of Cutting Records, this is Sapphire. This is Don't Break My Heart. And this is a really good freestyle song. I want to say it came out around 87. Okay, so that does it for my 12-inch singles. And let's break out the L the uh, 45s. Okay, on 45s, and everybody knows when you go to a record store, a lot of the 45s are located on the bottom of the rack. They're usually in a large box with 300 to 500 45s in no particular order. And you got to stoop over, hurting your back, and going through it. With this particular record store, I can walk right up to the 45s, and they got everything organized in the bins. It's so nice. You know, you got your pop rock. They have uh, uh, hip-hop, rap, pictured covers, rock. Everything is, is very organized. So I want to share with you those 45s that I got from that record shop. I've never seen this before. Uh, this is the 45 of the Jones & Crew, Pack Jam. And this is a uh, German pressing. So I'm very lucky to get that one. Uh, I like uh, old school freestyle electro. I like Freeze, IOU. So I picked that one up. Uh, the, all these 45s are only a dollar. I just could not go wrong with it. The S Express, the theme from the S Express. There it is. Good uh, kind of like acid house music. This is more hip hop. Hip House Music. This is uh, Street Tough by Double Trouble and the Rebel MC. And I think the Rebel MC also had Buckwheat, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, uh, Matt Hayes. Uh, please please tune into his channel. It's very good. And he's shown uh, a 45. And I, and I told him in one of my comments that I would get it. It's uh, Voyage Voyage by Desireless. Really love that song. It's off of CBS Records. Import. Very good. Uh, Tyler Disco. I picked up uh, Happy Station by Fun Fun. Off of Tail Deck Records. I think that's a, a Italian pressing. And also on uh, the EBM music, I got OK OK. And I also got that on 12-inch uh, single. This is off of West Side Record Label. Another, I guess, more hip house, acid house, Easy by Ice MC. There it is off of ZYX Records. Okay, that does it for the 45s from that record store. Okay, the second record store I went to that had 
the really nice records in that bargain bin I got and I found this one. I paid a little more money for it. The other ones were a dollar. These were like, I guess about five bucks a piece. I picked up Freak, Freaks Come Out at Night by Houdini. Near mint condition. Nice cover. It's got the uh, the poly protector on there also. I got another copy of Jam on it. And when I picked this one up, right here, just flawless. I couldn't believe. And the record is flat. No warps at all. Just flawless. There it is. Jam on it. And that's a classic. I just had to get that on 45. That's a better condition. People are People by Depeche Mode. Of course, Depeche Mode, all-time favorite synth pop band. Here I got Relax by Frankie Goes to Hollywood. And the last record I want to display for you is ABC Be Near Me. But the reason I got this record is on side B. It's called A to Z. I had a friend of mine from work. Uh, he used to uh, be friends with a DJ, and he would play this song called A to Z. Martin Fry, F-R-Y. Really good. Synth pop. I guess came out 85, 86. So some good music there. So that concludes part two. Stay tuned for part three. It's going to be some good stuff. And also I'm going to display some CDs for you. So thank you so much, my friends. And y'all have a good day.